Change continues its relentless march even through the year 2020. Now, according to a new report by the World Med Department, this year is on track to be one of the hottest years on record. Now, 2020 has seen new extreme temperatures on both land, sea and also the Arctic. The global mean temperature for this year is about 1.2 degrees centigrade above the pre-industrial levels. Now, this decade, that is from 2011 till 2020, will be the hottest decade on record, with the hottest six years have all been recorded since 2015. Now, according to the World Meteorological Organization's report, it shows as to have high-impact events such as extreme heat, wildfires and floods affected millions of people. This has also compounded threats to human health, security and economic stability that have already been posed by the COVID-19 pandemic. Now, ocean heat is at record levels. More than 80% of the global ocean experienced a marine heat wave at some time in 2020. And this has resulted in some widespread repercussions for marine ecosystems, which are already suffering from more acidic waters due to carbon dioxide's absorption. The severe flooding has affected millions, of East, millions in East Africa, South Asia and China. In Africa, Sudan and Kenya, remember these of course have been the nations have been, which have been worst hit with at least 285 deaths having been reported in Kenya and about 155 in Sudan. Now, India experienced one of the two wettest monsoon seasons since 1994. August was the wettest month on record for Pakistan and there was widespread flooding that was reported from throughout the region. In China, persistent high rainfall during the monsoon season also caused some severe flooding. At least 279 people lost their lives. And in terms of loss of property, it is said to have exceeded over 15 billion U.S. dollars. In South America, severe drought has affected many parts in the year 2020. The worst affected areas are that of northern Argentina, Paraguay and Brazil. Wildfires consumed vast areas in Australia, Siberia, the U.S. West Coast and also South America, sending plumes of smoke circumnavigating the globe. In the United States, the largest fires ever recorded occurred this year. July till September have been the hottest and also the driest on record for southwest United States. The California's Death Valley reached a scorching temperature of about 54.4 degrees Celsius in the month of August. And this was the highest known temperature in the world in the last 80 years. And also record-breaking temperatures and months of drought fueled a series of massive bushfires across Australia an area the size of South Korea, roughly from 25.5 million acres, burnt down in the fires. The fires destroyed thousands of homes and also killed over 1 billion animals. The 2020 also saw a record number of hurricanes in the Atlantic, including the unprecedented back-to-back -back Category 4 hurricanes in Central America. The two Category 4 hurricanes, such as Eta and Iota, made their landfalls in Central America in less than a span of two weeks in the month of November, resulting in devastation and flooding. The number of tropical cyclones globally, on an average, in, nine, in the year 2020, has been 96. The Cyclone Ampun near the India-Bangladesh border was the costliest tropical cyclone on record in the Indian Ocean region. Losses in terms of life were... Losses in terms of property were about $14 billion that were reported. The final WMO Global Climate Report will be published in March 2021. The report is based on contributions of dozens of international experts and it warns that humanity is currently not on track in mitigating the crises and that more global efforts are needed.